Welcome to Mysteries of Mars, an epic journey in which I present out of place anomalous objects and structures I discovered on Mars. I'm Jean Ward, independent South African Mars researcher. Hello everybody, Jean here. We're looking at another huge plane in the southern mid-latitudes of Mars called Halus Planitia and the site we're looking at is located in Bad Water. We'll be taking a closer look at a huge complex surface feature. I spotted this anomaly in the photograph called Central Structure of an Impact Crater, the thumbnail for this is missing so I'm not quite sure why that's been removed this photograph was acquired on the 14th of April 2012 at a resolution of 26.4 centimeters per pixel with one by one binning and I'll be showing you a crop from this huge JP2 black and white map projected file 1.45 gigabytes in size and he has a crop from the low res black and white photograph and we'll be looking at the strange surface feature in the top right of the JP2 photograph it's really washed out and you struggle to see details in the JP2 I'll show you that in a moment so we have Alice Planitia and the site we're looking at is in bad water at approximately 32 degrees 50 minutes south, 62 degrees 13 minutes east. So yeah, I've opened that huge JP2 in eye view. So let's zoom in on that anomaly located to the top in this photograph. Just look at this how washed out it is and very grainy. If we go actual size we can't see any details. I wonder why. So let's zoom out a bit. Check how washed out this is. What's this done on purpose? Let's have a look at the anomaly and I've tried to clean it up and add a bit of brightness and contrast to it. Yeah, we're looking at a screenshot of that area in the photograph. And the width of that one part is 210 pixels. So it's roughly 55 meters across. And yeah, we're looking at that complex surface feature where I've cleaned it up. I've removed the compression and that overlay that they seem to have added to the photograph I've added a bit of contrast and reduced the brightness so this part over here is approximately 55 meters across so what do you guys and girls reckon this could be? it's a very odd surface feature, very complex there's some geometry as well but rectangular parts long straight lines with odd angles it looks natural but also there's an element to this that looks unnatural in my opinion it looks like this material is covering caverns underneath like this is almost like a canopy or a structure on top could this be a bridging part where you could actually walk underneath look at these long narrow ports Highly complex. Did you get that part there? Bridges that gap. 
It's definitely above the surface. I want now far down. This goes. Could this be some type of old structure? Some type of surface mining activity? It's huge. Just this part here alone is 55 meters across. So you can imagine going there and walking along the top and looking down into these huge caverns. It's got to be one heck of a sight. It looks almost similar to that material that covers that cavern in Hydrate's Chaos. It looks like a web or like a root system. I wonder if it's similar type of material. So you could almost wonder, was this washed out on purpose to hide detail? This is the original JP2 downloaded from the NASA site. Now is that you can't see any detail And why is the thumbnail for that NASA page also missing? Could they be hiding something or is it just coincidence, folks? So to give you some context, we're in Google Earth Mars. Just to show you where the site is. So we have Hellas Planitia, a low plane. Coronae Planum, Alice Chasma, a deep, elongated, steep sided depression, Peneus Palace, a swamp, small plain, like the way they put that in inverted commas, and then we have bad water see what they classify this as a circular depression bad water interesting name if you consider Peneus Palace is a swamp in inverted commas so yeah I've pinned that thumbnail to that site in Google Earth Mars so without a doubt our red neighbor, Mars, is a beautiful place. Marvelous scenery, some complex structures and features that we can go and check out one day. Man, I'd love to walk around here and check out these huge structures. And then just a uh, ultra close up again. This reminds me of something that the artist H.R. Giger would put together. Fantastic. I'd love to hear what you think of this huge complex landform. Bad water in Alice Planitia. That's a very interesting name that they've given that circular depression. As always, thanks for watching.